Hello everyone, welcome back for another video. Today we are washing the CLA. It is not super filthy, but I will show you some footage in a second. So my hair is really messy, but the hairdressers in Belgium are still closed, so sorry for that. But I know you guys don't care about that. So don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button to support me, really important. But today we're taking a look at Revita from Labo Cosmetica, which is a wash and coat shampoo. The product itself smells really damn good, like all the Labo Cosmetica products do. It is a wash and coat shampoo, it is pH neutral. It will leave a protection behind on the car after washing it, so we are going to sn snow foam the car and uh, wash it with the Revita. This car has still some Fuso wax on it, I will show you in a minute, but most of it is dead, so I will show you some places where we can test it really out and see if it leaves a hydrophobic finish. Um, it is mostly for cars that are coated to extend the um, life of the coating, but you can also wash a non-coated car or non protected car with it and it will leave a protection layer behind. It will provide beading and shading on the paint and it will protect it from bird drops and other dirt and debris that is on the road. So we will start, I will put this in the foam gun, we will start with that. So there is almost no shading or beading, we will see what it looks like on the hood. But also there, there is almost no Beating. There is a little bit of sheeting, but the fuso is mostly dead on the paint. So we will see what the Labo stuff can do. Also on the door panels. It just sticks to the paint, so no protection on there. It smells already really damn good. Okay, so I filled this up with some hot water. I'm just gonna shake it and then we're spraying it on. We'll see how good it foams. The product doesn't make thick foam at all and doesn't remove a lot of dirt from the paint. But that's of course not the purpose of the product. There was only some dust on the paintwork and that flies, so it didn't really matter. Now I could see how hydrophobic car could get after a foam and rinse. Revita should sit on the paint for a minimal of four months if you take a bit of care of it and don't wash it with degreasers and stuff. After you rinse the product activates and you immediately see the water rolling off the paint. So it is also possible to just foam your car with the product and rinse it off to add some protection on the paint. Which makes it also a pretty easy and quick product to use. I did about 60 milliliters of the product into the bucket because it is a very dilutable product. 1 to 200 for a coated car and 1 to 100 for a non coated car. So, for people that like a good smelling product, this is perfect. It also feels very slick, but it's which is pretty important. It also removes the bugs and the bug splatters pretty easily. It is pH neutral, so it won't strip your waxes off. Also pretty important, of course. I 
I can see a pretty good before and after, it leaves a nice hydrophobic layer to the paint, so enjoy these after shots. After applying the product, the drying immediately gets much easier. Last step of the process will be applying Perfecta Quick Detailer to the paint because the nice thing about Labo products is that they go hand in hand with each other. It could be possible with bad use of Revita that it leaves marks on the paint. And what I mean with bad use is using direct sunlight and with Perfecta you can remove them pretty easily. Honestly, the Revita leaves a very nice gloss finish on the paint, but the Perfecta turns the gloss to 110%. It also will remove water spots, adds protection and leaves a very nice and slick finish. This will be the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please give it a thumbs up, subscribe and I'll see you guys on the next one. Ciao!